right, guys, time to get airborne here and so much fun with the iPad Pro. Well, iPad Air or the iPhone here. Remember, you have to meet the target, shoot into the flight path. You can do a little victory roll here by swiping left or right. These are the missiles. They hit their target. These are slightly upgraded ones. And here we got incoming hard to evade for me because I cannot hear as I'm recording this the, beeping, the screen recording is able to sound so I'm flying death death and I'm gonna get hit a lot with that I don't know how close they are as the beeping gets uh, more intense as they get closer you'll see anyways now we can hear the sound it gets recorded and I still have 17 of the slightly upgraded missiles and 341 shots and the machine gun, but then it reverts back to very basic. Gyro in the iPad Air. And here you go, I didn't know how close it was coming. I knew it was coming from the little arrow here that's flashing. It tells you from which direction it's coming. You need to get really close to you, so you have to de decelerate here on the left-hand side. Press the down arrow and get, you can fly narrower turns. If you fly too fast, you can never get close to them. You have to turn shorter. And slow, here we go. Okay, here's the next one, balancing and shooting into the flight path. Wave complete, and we're gonna be doing something in the Arctic, over the ocean, and a few scenes here for you. Ready. So, this illustrates how nice it is to hold an iPad, an iPhone, iPad Pro in your hand and steer. Very natural. No joystick and so forth needed. It's very intuitive to fly. Here again, I cannot hear when they hit me. When I was so close the missile is, so I can time my evasive maneuver. And sometimes I'm doing doing even the wrong maneuver. Anyways, you've got a close one here. Line up. Target. As those waves progress, there's going to be more and more fighters upon us. One of the great iPad right from the Classic game. Wish they'd upgrade the graphics a little bit for us here, the detail. Adjust that for the iPad Pro. This could go much higher resolution if we wanted to, even though I don't even record the full resolution here for you right now. But um, the game could need a slight. Coming here from the top right. I should have ducked. Hindsight is always 2020. I'm not a huge gamer, but um, once in a while I like to fly a little bit, I like to race a little bit. It's liberating. This machine gun packs surely a punch. This is also a very basic fighter here basic airplane. The machine gun takes care of this, remember to lead the target. Now we got four against us, I doubt we'll survive it. I'm almost out of life here. Here we got incoming. Hit us of course, I can do anything about it. Missing it was way too close. We got all four. We don't want them to spread out, so it's key to hit them very early on from a distance. Once they're all around you from different sides, you get into crossfire, and then it's going to be very difficult to evade those missiles. Here it comes. We got this one for Jane. Yeah, I'm so excited I'm doing a roll. Don't do that. You know, just use your energy. The level bar on the side goes slightly back up here on the left, but it takes time. And if we get hit, about it. Let's go into the Iron Sea here over Markovia. Sounds like the Avengers movie. Was it Markovia? What was it? They're going to survival mode. That's what it is. And 
I'm starting fresh. I'm not signed into my game center, so start <laughs> the complete new person. I guess. Also, the machine gun heats up. Far away, that's where we gotta get them. Far, far away. There's incoming. He's able to evade this one. Sometimes you can see the missile, sometimes you cannot. There we go. Taking care of this one. Very resisting. So now we're based back to the basic missiles. It shows you the infinity sign on top of the right missile means we have infinite missiles but they're slower they're not as accurate and they do less damage so there you have it I used the screen capture software so I didn't hear it when I was playing like I said I it's probably a better way of doing it. I see a camera symbol here in the back. Oh no, that's probably just the camera angle. Never mind. Thought I could record it from within the software. Well, maybe I can. Anyway, just to get you in the mood, or just watch me fail and get shot out of the of the sky. It's a nice way to start 2016 with some gaming. Not just camera and phone reviews and lenses and well, all the tech stuff. If you like gaming, tablets and phones are so much fun these days. Not quite the same thing as a dedicated gaming console, but the games that it leads to are slightly different, so having one or the other can't hurt. Both are have their place. We're back here in the Green Mountains. Um, in terms of looks, probably my least favorite, because if you go closer to the mountains, fly lower, and you can see um, that they didn't give us too much detail. So now we got one on the left, one on the right. They're going to corner us. Um, at wave number two, they're not too aggressive yet. And we got incoming from top left. And then here when it was coming. Of course I'm gonna get hit. I think the furthest I've gotten is wave 13 and then it just gets too stressful. That is behind us. Try to turn behind and below. Actually, the bottles. And have to accelerate to get a little bit closer within range. Now we got lock on. There we go. We deploy one missile, and I like to deploy the second one a little bit later in case he does an evasive maneuver. If you shoot them back to back, that one evasive maneuver is taking care of both uh, missiles, and you it's time to reload. So shoot one two then it's time to reload that takes a while one and we got incoming straight on yep, and we got another one from the left so that was again a terrible invasive maneuver on my part um, see I shot way too early here so the missiles are not going to catch him from this distance but I got them machine gun the closer you get the more you have to leave the target with the missile so that the missile has a chance physically to catch that enemy airplane it only flies at a certain speed. The missile. And here comes one from the left, one from the right. We have two comets incoming here. They both hit me. It's almost sad to watch, um, but hey. Otherwise, I'd be playing forever and not get any work done. No reviews for you guys. I have like four or five reviews planned. So this is sort of like uh, me procrastinating on those. Meaning, I should be doing more reviews instead of gaming. You should be doing your homework instead of gaming. Or your work. Let's lead the target here. That's easy. I'm 
almost out of life here, so... I get another wave of... Three, hopefully we can take out one... In that wave before it's for my time to, time to go down. We got income from the left. And I did my maneuver too soon. Didn't hear it. And we got them on top of us. Going very fast. That little roll here did next to nothing. Okay. And going back to those mountains. I like this map here, the Arctic, I think. Looks like the Arctic. Or some very high mountains. Mountains in the Arctic. Flying kind of low. We know they are now to the left behind that mountain. Let's go around it. Let's see where they're at. We already got incoming. That sucks. Boop, 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 boop. Got that one. And I guessed it. Punishing. Punishing. We need to with some missile. This one too. First one, a clear miss. The second hits him. Damages it. Here we go. Wave number three. He is in the distance. That's where you gotta get him. And we got a missile incoming from the left. And one from the right. And it gives a long warning. I just reacted way too soon. Didn't know how close it was. No idea. No. Both shots here missed. So let's deploy the machine gun. He's diving right down and giving me a clear flight path. That's an indication to just aim it a little bit before his nose. And then he's flying right into those bullets. Oh yeah. So we got a pack of three to the left already with incoming. Two missiles deployed. One evaded. Second one evaded. And the third one, oh, I guess that's what was going on. Not as I'm just split up. Sooner the better. With a little bit of practice, you can easily get this wave 10. Just knock these guys out really fast. Also, you'll get faster airplanes and faster missiles. We just need one missile and it's done deal. You need to deploy two and they both miss. Actually, I missed, but the very unforgiving is basic missiles. Almost like fireworks. It's actually fun watching yourself play afterwards. There's absolutely no anxiety while playing. It's comedic, almost. So, iPad Pro, iPod Touch, iPad Air 2, iPad Air, iPhone 6S, 6S Plus, and so forth. Great at doing this game. I'll have the gyro built in. Sorry, I just knocked the microphone. They have the gyro built in, so they know exactly which way you're tilting. Backwards, forwards, left, and right. Um, play this with headphones, the music, the soundtrack, the effects. Very stunning. Stunning. There's different modes. There's a campaign mode. And a multiplayer mode against other people. I get, I get too upset with that. And then there's that mode where you can play survival mode. With more and more and more until you're done. Recommend playing the multiplayer mode. That's what gets interesting because uh, people have different strategies of playing than the computer or the artificial intelligence. Here we go. We're deploying two missiles. Both miss. We got incoming. Critical damage strike. I think it's time for me to clock out here. Fly into the night. Wish you a happy new year, 2000. 16 and remember don't buy anything you won't use if it doesn't make you happy don't buy it so much to buy so much money to spend you got so much stuff laying around uh, enjoy what you have if it's an old ipod touch work with that don't buy unless you're sure you want it all right that's tech reviews wishing you a happy new year thank you so much for watching all my 
so-so reviews. And um, it won't be game over just yet for tech reviews. Bye.